Welcome to Bridge On, providers of the world's finest Remy Human Hair Extensions. This introductory training video will provide you with the basic technical knowledge on hair qualities, preparing for and applying fusion and microlink techniques, cutting and styling tips, and care and maintenance. As one of the fastest growing hair extension companies in the world, our goal is the complete satisfaction of our clients. To accomplish this goal, we are committed to supporting you, the technical team, who will become part of our talented network of professional Brijon stylists. We look forward to working with you and thank you for your dedication to the professional installation of hair extensions. Brijon was founded with over 15 years of experience in the hair extension industry. Our founders have deep ties in the local Indian community, enabling us to select our hair from the finest temples and salons. We use only 100% Remy hair whereby the cuticles are intact and run in the same direction. Aligned cuticles add longevity to the hair extension and keep the hair from tangling. Brijan offers four types of hair extensions, keratin tips, eye tips, wefts, and bulk. Keratin and eye tips contain 0.8 grams of Remy hair and are crafted with a 100% protein-based Italian polymer. All wefts and bulk extensions weigh 100 grams or 3.5 ounces. X Remy Pro hair extensions are always free from harmful chemicals and silicone. Brijan is the only global brand to offer four applications, keratin tips, eye tips, wefts, and bulk hair in seven different styles. We also offer over 40 colors and 100% natural virgin hair. Client communication and assessment is a critical first step to determine the most appropriate product and application method. The consultation should include the initial assessment, client goals, and client responsibilities. In the client assessment, Evaluate the client's hair, including the texture and fall pattern. Measure the client's head to determine the required hair extensions. Finally, discuss past experiences with extensions and any existing issues. Next, agree on the client's goals. Assess client's goals for volume, length, style, or to add highlights, and confirm that hair extension are the correct strategy. Determine the type and volume of hair extensions to be installed. Select color and or colors and style and determine the desired application method. Finally, review client responsibilities and expectations, including the costs of installation and removal, ongoing maintenance, and the importance of recurring consultations. We suggest documenting the client consultation process to ensure that the stylist and client have a record of the discussion and are in agreement with the strategy. We are now ready to begin the preparation and application of hair extensions. Before beginning the application, it is important to prepare the hair. First, wash the hair with a deep cleansing or clarifying shampoo. Do not use conditioner or moisturizers. After washing, towel dry the hair and comb thoroughly to remove all tangles. Next, blow dry the hair so that it is completely dry. You never want to install extensions directly to wet or damp hair. Finally, use a professional straightening iron to leave the client's hair straight before installation. After preparation, the hair must be sectioned. First, comb the client's hair to its natural fall pattern and ensure that all tangles and knots are removed. Keep in mind the installation strategy for volume and look when sectioning the hair. Next, divide the hair in four equal sections, parting the hair using clips. We will apply the extensions using a straight to U-shape pattern as it is the most common technique and follows the natural curvature of the head. For the first row, begin one half inch or 1.25 centimeters from the bottom hair line. Make the first row straight across with a slight curve as required. 
leave approximately one inch or two and one half centimeters from the hairline on both sides of the head. A total of four to six rows can be installed depending on the volume and installation strategy. Subsequent rows should be about one half inch to three quarters of an inch apart or 1.25 centimeters to two centimeters apart depending on the volume to be installed. You may now begin the application process. Brijan's keratin tips are made from 100% human Remy Indian hair and a specially formulated protein-based Italian polymer for the keratin tip end. Before you begin, be sure to have all your tools ready for the application, including the fusion connector or iron, hair separator discs and clips, keratin pliers, hair extension brush, scissors, X-keratin bond remover if removing the extensions, hot razor, and the keratin tips that will be applied. Plug in the fusion connector and give it a minute to heat up to the desired temperature. For Brajon's fusion connector, the ideal temperature is between 180 and 200 degrees Celsius. This temperature or setting may vary if using other types of connectors such as the ultrasonic connector. After the hair is divided, begin in the center of the first row and separate a small portion of the client's hair. The amount of hair should be approximately the same as the hair extension. Place the separated hair in the hair separator disc so the client's hair falls naturally. Place the keratin tip on the client's hair about one half inch or 1.25 centimeters from the root. Place the tip on top of the client's own hair. Using the fusion connector, proceed to melt the keratin for two to three seconds until it begins to bubble. The keratin should be melted, but be careful not to apply the connector for too long as it may damage the keratin polymer and weaken the bond. Once the keratin has melted, wait two to three seconds for the keratin to cool and use your fingertips to gently fold and press the keratin flat. We suggest using finger protectors if desired. Maintain a downward direction while melting and forming the keratin tip. This will allow the hair and extension to lay flat against the head. Finally, use the keratin pliers to seal the keratin. It is critical that the keratin bond is completely sealed. If there are any grooves, holes, or air pockets in the bond, water and shampoo can penetrate the keratin and cause the bond to weaken. Some stylists prefer to seal the keratin by rolling instead of pressing flat. Although this technique can be used, it is very important that the keratin is rolled smooth and cylindrical without any air pockets. Once the strand has been applied, remove the disc and verify there is free movement of the extension in all directions. This is very important to ensure comfort and longevity. The next extension should be applied next to this one about one half inch or 1.25 centimeters away. After the first row is completed, the stylist should double check all of the bonds before moving on. Additional rows should be applied directly above the previous one. Section the row in a straight to U shape to follow the natural growth of the hair. Repeat the same application process until you have installed the entire row. When applying the extensions, it will be important to note where the hair is thin, especially on the sides. In these areas, you can vertically cut the keratin tips in half. The same application procedures should be followed 
maintaining a 50% ratio between the client's hair and the hair extension. This same method is used for highlights as well. Once all rows and keratin tips have been applied, proceed to cut and style the client's hair as presented later in the video. Your client should not shampoo their hair for at least 48 hours after the keratin extensions have been applied. Removing the keratin extension should always be done by a trained stylist and never by the client. To remove, divide the hair in the same way as when it was applied. For each strand, apply one to two drops of remover on the bonded area and massage in with your fingers. Use the keratin pliers to squeeze and break the bond. Breaking the bond can also be done before applying the remover. Directly above the bond, hold and support the hair. From the end of the extension, gently slide the extension away from the head. Finally, comb out any residue that remains on the hair, using additional remover if necessary. After removing all extensions, clean thoroughly with X shampoo and X conditioner. Note, do not use conditioner if you are reinstalling or adjusting hair extensions. Brijan's eye tips are made for 100% human Remy Indian hair and a specially formulated protein-based Italian polymer. Before you begin, be sure to have all your tools ready for the application, including the hair separator disc and clips, Brijan steel plier set with pliers, pulling needle and ring separator, micro rings, hair extension brush, scissors, hot razor, multifunctional fusion connector if applying with fusion tubes, and the eye tips that will be applied. After the hair is divided, begin in the center of the first row and separate a small portion of the client's hair. The amount of hair should be approximately the same as the hair extension. Place the separated hair in the hair separator disc and orient the disc upward so the client's hair falls naturally. Place one or several rings on the base of the pulling needle. If applicable, the wide side of the ring should face down towards the handle. Using the end of the pulling needle, Hook the separated hair and close the latch. Once the hair has been secured, draw the client's hair through the micro ring. Keep your finger on the micro ring and hair to maintain the position of the ring close to the separator disc. Slide the eye tip into the ring with a very small portion of the tip visible at the top. Leave approximately one half inch or 1.25 centimeters of space between the root and the ring so that the ring rests naturally in the fall pattern of the hair. The eye tip should not poke out very far from the ring as this may cause discomfort. With your pliers, crimp the ring securely while holding the hair downwards. This will allow the extensions to lay flat against the head and maintain complete movement in all directions. You can also use the fusion tube technique to apply eye tips. Follow the same process to attach the hair and tube with the pulling needle and then use the multifunctional fusion connector to adhere the tube to the eye tip and the client's hair. Seal by rolling the eye tip with your fingers. The next extension should be applied next to this one, about one half inch or 1.25 centimeters of space between each eye tip. After the first row is completed, the stylist should double check all of the connection points before moving on.
Additional rows should be applied directly above the previous one. Section the new row and install a straight to U-shape pattern following the natural growth of the hair. Repeat the same application process until you have installed the entire row. Once all rows and eye tips have been applied, proceed to cut and style the client's hair as presented later in the video. To remove eye tips, use the pliers to squeeze the corners of the micro ring. Once open, easily slide the eye tip and micro ring down and away from the hair. Fusion tubes can be removed using the keratin bond remover and the same technique as with the keratin tips. Apply a few drops of remover and use pliers to break and loosen the fusion tube. Holding the hair above the eye tip, slide the hair extension down and away. Once all rings or tubes have been removed, comb out any residue and wash the hair thoroughly with X shampoo and X conditioner. Do not use conditioner if you are reinstalling or moving the hair extensions. Brijan wefts are made from 100% human Remy Indian hair and are triple stitched to reduce shedding and maintain longevity. Before you begin, be sure to have all your tools ready for the application, including the hair separator disc and clips, Brijan steel plier set with pliers, pulling needle and ring separator, micro rings, hair extension brush, scissors, hot razor, and the weft that will be applied. Determine ahead of time the number of rows to be installed. The number of rows typically range from 3 to 5 rows with 1 half inch or 1.25 centimeters between rows. For each row, measure the length of the head from ear to ear and cut the weft to the correct sizes, leaving 1 inch or 2.5 centimeters from the client's hairline. Smaller pieces may be installed on the side. Next, section the first row. Using clips, secure the weft along the first row to begin the application process. The weft should be installed about a half inch or one to one and a half centimeters from the root. The double-sided portion of the weft should be facing outwards it is very important that the wefts lay flat so that the hair doesn't feel bulky. Starting at one end, lift and separate a small portion of the hair from the weft and a matching volume of the client's hair below. The amount of hair should be approximately the same. Place one or several rings on the base of the pulling needle. If applicable, the wide side of the ring should face down towards the handle. Using the end of the pulling needle, hook the separated hair and close the latch. Holding the weft and the ring, close the micro ring firmly. The ring should be closed just below the weft line. Secure a second ring in the same manner immediately next to the first one to secure the end of the weft. The same procedure should be performed across the weft with about one half inch or 1.25 centimeters of space between each connection point. Always remember to close the micro ring in a downwards position. This will help the weft and hair to lay flat against the client's head. This is critical or the hair will stick out away from the head and look unnatural. Wefts can also be installed with clips for easy and quick installation and removal. After measuring and cutting the wefts, sew the clips approximately every 2 to 3 inches. 
There are a variety of sizes to choose from, ranging from 2.3 to 3.6 centimeters based on the length of the weft and client preferences. Section the hair in the same method and close the clips along the selection lines. Lift up the back portion of the client's hair where the wefts have been connected and locate the micro rings. Using the pliers, squeeze the micro ring to open and slide the ring downwards and free. Repeat to remove all the micro rings. Once all of the rings have been opened, slide the entire weft off. Comb and wash the hair thoroughly with X shampoo and X conditioner. If you are reinstalling or adjusting the hair extensions, do not use conditioner. After finishing the application of the hair extensions, it is important to cut and style the hair so the extensions blend properly. First, apply X Reconstructor before combing to improve styling and manageability. Next, gently separate the extensions and brush the hair using the hair extension brush. After parting and combing the hair, use Brijon's hot razor to cut and blend the hair extensions. After cutting, blow dry the hair or style with Brijon's X Styler. For keratin tips, it is important to not apply heat near the bonds when blow drying or straightening as the keratin bond can become damaged. Brijon offers several installation techniques. Depending on the condition of the hair extensions, the stylist may want to create or replace extensions after a period of time. For this and all other modifications, Brijon offers additional tools and training. Two key techniques for retipping hair strands are to create keratin and eye tip extensions using keratin grains or Brijon's preformed keratin replacement tips. Before you begin, be sure to have all your tools ready for the application, including the flat fusion connector or multifunctional fusion connector, Brijon's high quality Italian keratin grain, scissors, Brijon's preformed keratin replacement tips, and the hair strands to be bonded. Separate the hair strands to be tipped and place a few keratin grains directly on the fusion connector. Wait a few seconds for the keratin to melt and run the hair strands through the connector and melted keratin. Slide the hair through a second time. Wait a few seconds for the keratin to cool slightly. Then, shape the tip with your finger and trim. Alternately, preformed keratin replacement tips can be purchased from Brijon. These tips can be melted and connected directly to the hair strands. The eye tip can be created in the same method as the keratin grains by passing the hair strands through the holes in the multifunctional connector and then rolling. It is important to ensure the size is small enough to fit into the rings. Trim the end of the tip as necessary. After installing Brijon hair extensions, it is critical to review the necessary care and maintenance procedures with the client. Provide a copy of Brijon's care and maintenance procedures to the client and discuss any questions with them. 100% Remy Human Hair Extensions require very special care. Clients should use only professional products designed for hair extensions to maintain a healthy appearance and feel. Brijon's wet line is ideal for managing the hair extensions and includes X Shampoo, X Conditioner, X Reconstructor and X Polishing Milk. These products are specially formulated for Remy cuticle hair and all human hair extensions. Consistent use will extend the life of the hair extensions, eliminate frizz and flyaway, and reduce knots and tangling. Finally, the client should sign a waiver of liability contract 
so they understand their responsibility for maintaining the hair extensions. The client should also schedule a follow-up appointment two weeks after the installation to check the extensions and make any adjustments. Ongoing communication between the stylist and client is important to ensure any issues are quickly addressed. We have just covered some of the technical information about Brijon's Remy Human Hair Extensions and application techniques. Brijon's full product line and global market presence gives you the opportunity to join a growing network of professional and talented stylists. By becoming part of the Brijon family, you will be expanding your professional services and increasing revenue. We are constantly looking for new talent to join our technical team of trainers and distributors. Please inquire directly for more information. Thank you for your dedication to professional stylist education and we look forward to working with you as a new member of the Brijan family.